I think Amsterdam uh, for a lot of people is a very picturesque place. Maybe a little bit too picturesque. It doesn't necessarily have the rough edge that some other places have. And just walking around is like almost feels like walking around in a, in a, in a museum sometimes. We are in my in-between studio. I just um, got a new place. Uh, I got a new studio which I'm building right next door. It's finished almost. You just uh, one day too early. We're in a place called the West Islands. It used to be kind of like a docking and boating area, I guess, a long, long time ago. The house I live in actually used to be, um, I think, a boat factory or something. There's still some boating going on, like here and over there. It's a very small market. I have a boat, for instance, and I haven't managed to find someone that can actually fix it here. We are headed to the, as we say in Dutch, gashouder. <laughs> it's a gas holder from the uh, Wester gas factory. And this is where they are right now building up the uh, awakening setup for the weekends. This is uh, the Awakenings Techno Temple. And I came here about 22 years ago for the first time as a visitor. I remember sitting on the balcony over there and listening to the music maybe at 7 in the morning, you know, banging techno, still already light outside. It's kind of top secret, you know, we're not allowed to actually film this. The thing about Awakenings is they always have a crazy lighting LED design. You never know what it's going to be like. Next stop is a nice little cocktail bar of a friend of mine, Guillermo, who's running it. He's a music head as well. I think it's the best cocktails in town. And it's also really nice to have a place where, you know, you feel at home. Guillermo, how's it going, man? You can only play the piano if you can play around it. I can't, sorry. <laughs> So here we are at HPS, aka Hiding in Plain Sight. This is Guillermo. I've been coming here since, uh, since he opened, basically, which I just heard has been seven years ago. <laughs> Cheers. And take care. Cool. We'll see you soon. See you. A DJ friend of mine called Kalsh gave me a skateboard last year for my 40th birthday. He sent it to me saying, uh, stay young. And then I picked up skateboarding after not having done it for about 20 years or more. We are at uh, Skate Park North. This is a, an amazing place that was set up like a year ago. I like to come here myself, just skate, let off some steam. I was never really much of a street skater, more of a mini ramp skater. And so that's still what I like the most. The scene at the moment is bigger than it's ever been in Amsterdam. Playing to the audience here is amazing because it's a very democratic room. It's round, so everyone is kind of in the best spot. We're a small country, we're a small city. But music wise, we have a big footprint. It's really great to be able to organize such an event for the world. Yeah. 